Mis pasión con ustedes para un minuto. Juan, primeramente saludos y respetos. Hopefully everyone's having a good one right now. Um, my weekend was good, but check this one out. You know, um, I never really come on here and and, and voice my opinion or, you know, um, I don't try to get negative or whatnot. But I felt like this was necessary for me to get on here because it's heavy on my mind how some people <clears throat> with the influence as far as they made a name for themselves and um, a lot of people know so they have a platform you know uh, the person I'm talking about is Chingo Bling not to get negative you know because that's not my get down bro but at the same time um, I'm gonna say one thing whether you're for Trump or Biden, I don't care. You're still you. And I'm saying this in general, okay? Your political inclinations, that's your business. You know what I mean? However, when it comes to the raza, viva la raza, and you ain't gonna be down for them, that's something else, bro. So check this one out. The dude, right? Um, if you don't know who he is, he's a rapper. He he, he came up in the 90s, uh, maybe late 90s, early 2000s. I remember seeing him the first time, like in around 2001 or two, right? Came out with a, with a couple of videos. At first, you know, I, I thought he was making fun of the Raza, but I guess that was just his style and he made money out of it. So check this out. I can't tell you not to eat. So if you made money from it, that's good. By all means, that's wonderful. However, <clears throat> recently, you know, with all this campaign, Trump, Biden, you know, people are divided, you know, and that's fine. Um, this is the land of the free, you know? Freedom of speech and, and freedom of religion. You got freedom of pretty much anything, bro, you know? Um, so check this one now. Uh, the dude, right? Um, he went on to make a video explain or trying to like, trying to convey the way that, you know, that he's thinking. And he, he pretty much try, try to justify it by, and I'm trying to like watch my words because I don't want to come out too strong. I just want to say it exactly how he said it, you know, so. Pretty much he said something along the lines that he's pro-Trump, which at that point, who cares, you know? That's your political views, that's fine. But then he said something like, uh, Trump is doesn't like uh, immigrants, you know? And uh, that's when he said, well, you know what? Um, he mentioned the health care for the immigrants, illegal immigrants, you know? Um, if you're Mexican, you're gonna have a tío, a tía, parents, maybe your brothers, sisters. Someone came from Mexico, you know what I mean? Or unless you've been here for a few generations and that's different, but still, your roots are over there, you know? So you can't just say Viva la Raza that's over here doing good. The Raza comes from Mexico. That's where the Raza was originated, you know? So, um, the dude said um, that since Trump doesn't like illegal immigrants and, and, and he feels like all illegal immigrants shouldn't, shouldn't get a free health care, you know? So when you say something like that, I just stop and, and I think, right, like illegal immigrants are the ones during the the COVID-19, bro, they were the ones working so we could eat. They were essential workers, most of them, bro, especially right here in my county of Ventura in California, you know. Um, they pay taxes. All their money gets taxed. So if you're not going to want the same thing that we're getting for them, then why should they be out there working, bro? Like, you're not going to work. I know I'm not gonna go to the fields and work, bro. 
and for that I respect them. And you know, this is the land of equality, homeboy. We all have the same rights. If you're paying taxes, you should have the same rights as anybody else here, bro. Straight up. So that's just my opinion. Um, you know what? If if you guys feel like um like I'm wrong, let me know. Let me know. I'm not trying to be negative, but at the same time, I feel like. In the minimum, this guy this should apologize. Minimum. You know what I mean? So, with that being said, I'm going to leave it here. I'm going to leave it there. Woo, woo, woo. And we, we're going to come back, you know what I mean? I just have to let it out of the way. Get it out of the way. Have a good one.